Welcome back to the NFL Combine. It's Mary Kay Cabot. It's Dan Labe. I'm Doug Maurice here at Cleveland.com. Three takeaways from Friday at the Combine, although it's Saturday, and the secret is you're not here anymore. So before you left, your takeaway was what? Uh, Joey Bosa is really impressive. Obviously, we've seen him on the field. Now, you've talked to him a lot. This is really one of the first times that, that I've been in a press conference setting with him. It took him a little bit. He warmed up, but he's a fun guy to listen to, and the Browns are going to have a tough decision to make at number two. He warmed up because I set up his jokes That's for true. him. Mary Kay Cabot, your takeaway. Uh, you know what? I listened to Paxton Lynch today, and I thought out of all the top three quarterbacks, he had the most dynamic personality. Uh, you know, Cordell Stewart popped in, and uh, and he pointed to him and said, hey, Slash, I've had your poster up in my uh, room in college all through the years. So uh, he had a lot of personality, and he's ready to come from behind. He's kind of the dark horse right now from these top three, and he's ready to show some things on workout day. I don't think the Browns can draft him because the height difference between Paxton and you would be too great. It would be hard for you to cover him. You know what? I would actually need to be standing on a milk crate a lot. Whatever it takes, Mary Kay Cabot. <laughs> uh, my takeaway is there are a bunch of Ohio State defensive guys in on Friday. I think you could pick up Ohio State's defense from last season and drop it in the NFL, and it might work. How they didn't make the playoff, I still don't know. Uh, he's Dan. He's Mary Kay. I'm Doug. Thanks for watching all of our combine coverage here at Cleveland.com.